Hi everyone, it's Jeff here from Avada. Today we're going to look at how to upload and use custom icons in Avada. In this video I'm going to show you how to both create and add your custom icon sets into Avada and also where to access them in the Avada Builder. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with all the latest videos like this one. And if you don't want to miss one, click the bell icon to get notifications of all new videos on our channel. Ok, let's begin. You can find the custom icon set feature at Avada Icons from the WordPress dashboard or just icons from the Avada dashboard. To get started with creating a custom icon set, simply give it a name. I'll just call this one Podcast and click on the Create New Icon Set button. This saves the empty set and takes you to the Edit Icon Set page where you can add your icons. The supported icon tool is the IcoMoon app. There is a link directly to the app on the page. Just click on that to open the app in a new tab. The IcoMoon app is very powerful and you can choose from the default IcoMoon set, import other free icon sets, and if you know your way around SVGs you can even upload your own custom icons. If we click on Add Icons from Library, you can see that there are a range of sets that you can purchase at the top, followed by a number of free icon sets that show Add at the bottom. These can be added to the app with one click. And at the bottom, some sets you can access if you become a premium member of IcoMoon. But for this set, I'll just select a few icons from the IcoMoon free set. Now I have my icons selected and we can see at the bottom in the middle just how many icons I have selected for the set. You can also manage and rename your project if you want to come back to it, but in this case I will just move to the next step which is click on Generate Font. This loads the selected fonts ready to download, but before you do that, it's important you go into the preferences by clicking on the small cog icon at the bottom here and making sure you create both a unique font name and CSS class prefix. I'll just edit these two. And it auto saves. I'll now click download and a zip file downloads to the computer. Ok, so if I now go back to the edit icon set page, I can now click on select file and choose the zip file I just downloaded. The icons load in the set and it auto saves. Just note that if you want to update or refresh an icon set, there is an update custom icon set button at the top here which takes you to the media library to allow you to re-upload a zip file for the icon set. There's also a download button next to this. This downloads the icon set as a JSON file, which you can use as a backup or to recreate the font set on IcoMoon. Ok, so now I have imported a custom icon set. Let's see how to use it in the builder. I'll just move over to an existing page and edit it. At the top of the page I have already changed the image that was here to an icon. If I edit the icon element and look at the icon picker, we can now see our custom set in its own tab, along with the font awesome icon sets we have selected in the global options. If I select the podcast tab, the icons I imported in the set are now showing in the icon picker and I can select them as I would any icon. I'll just choose an icon from this set. For more detailed information about how to use the icon element, please see our icon element video. But with this element you can manipulate the icon in many ways, including rotating it, making monochromatic icons to any colour you wish, and setting a rollover colour just to name a few of the options. Icons are also found in several other elements apart from the icon element, including the content boxes, button and checklist elements to name a few. So anywhere you find the icon picker, you will also find your custom icon sets. But if you just want to add a standalone icon, the icon element is your best bet. Ok, this concludes our video on how to upload and use custom icons in Avada. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with all the latest videos, and if you have any questions or need assistance, please create a support ticket and our team will gladly assist you. As always, we want to thank you for choosing Avada.